I am at Quarry Trails Metro Park. I'm going to show you the little cemetery here. They actually did some work on it. But to know exactly where it's at, you can see the maintenance building right there. I'm not really sure what that building there is. But anyway, it's right around these here. And you'll see this. This is the cemetery. They actually fixed it up quite a bit. It used to actually be right back in this brush. And most people didn't know it was here and would actually go right by it. But they've actually cleaned it up quite a bit. As with any of these old cemeteries, man, show respect. Look, don't touch. Leave the stones alone. Most of the stones are laying down. Died July 13th, 1855. 82 years old. Skidmore. Died December 29th, 1858. This is just one of the metro parks that actually have old cemeteries. There's a couple of them down at Battelle, Darby Creek. There's a couple of cemeteries, probably like two or three of them. Uh, off the top of my head, I can't think of what other ones have cemeteries. This one here died 1858, it looks like. Looks like it was a pedestal and the stone is gone. Ain't nothing over there. But it looks like this is probably was it right here. Died 1856. And there's two people here. The other one died in 1840. So that's for two people. Some of these you can't even read. They're so weather worn. I mean, it's like you can't even see anything on them anymore. First time I come back here, I saw one stone that had the initials WTF on it. Eighteen forty nine. 
Yeah, so far I haven't seen any later than 1860 for death. Eighteen thirty-eight. I'm not seeing a pattern for last names either, so I So next time you come on the quarry trails, make sure to check out this little cemetery. Like I said, they really cleaned it up a lot, so it's a lot easier to find and, and check out.